story in South Jersey. It's now been two days since a five-year-old girl vanished from a park in Cumberland County. An Amber Alert has been issued. Investigators say they believe she was abducted. CBS 2's Cleve Bryan reports. The only thing we're asking is for her to come back home safely. It's been more than 48 hours since five-year-old Dulce Maria Alves disappeared from Bridgeton City Park, and her family is desperate to have her home. We don't know who took her, who's with her, how she's doing and everything. The only thing we're trying to do is find her. Dulce was last seen between 4 and 5 o'clock Monday afternoon at this playground. She was with her three-year-old little brother. Meanwhile, her 19-year-old mother, Noema Alves Perez, was in her car with another family member about 50 yards away. The first 30 hours after the girl's disappearance, police conducted a full-scale search of the park and nearby waterways. At the same time, detectives launched a criminal investigation, which led them to conclude the girl was abducted. We don't have any solid suspects. We're investigating all the possibilities. Police were able to get enough information to issue an Amber Alert Tuesday night by tracking down people who were hanging around the basketball courts near the area where Dulce disappeared. At least one person was able to provide details about a possible kidnapper. Police are not sure if the suspect knows young Dulce or not. They say the girl's father is not in the U.S. and the rest of the victim's family is cooperating. She means a lot for me. I would give anything for her to come back. This is what police can tell us about the possible kidnapper. They say he is a light-skinned man, possibly Hispanic, standing between five foot six and five foot eight, with a thin build. They say he has no facial hair, but does have acne. He was last seen wearing orange sneakers, red pants, and a black shirt. They describe his vehicle as a red van, possibly a minivan with a slide door and tinted windows. Anyone with information should call police and they're asking all of us to please continue to share information about little Dulce on social media and be on the lookout. In Bridgeton, I'm Cleve Bryan for CBS 2 News.